Yo, what's happening, YouTube? It's your boy Paul Radio Man 2094 here. Back again with another video, of course. And today we're going to do a quick unboxing and taking a look at the Fitbit Versa 2. Now, you can pick this up on Amazon or Walmart.com or pick it up at Walmart. All the links up in the description. But anyways, let's get started on the video, so enjoy. Alright, so let's go through all the specs. Now you can pick this up from Fitbit.com or Amazon and Walmart.com or pick it up today at Walmart. Like, prices are very with this uh, device right here. But, let me, and then color choices, of course. I have it on the Fitbit website real quick, so let's go through this real quick. Alright, so, as you see here, this is the black and carbon aluminium. This is the one I'm reviewing today. And then you got stone and mist gray aluminium. And then you got yeah, petal and copper rose aluminium. So this is for the one for the ladies, of course. And then Bordeaux. Better color for the checks too, I guess. And then you got emerald. You got blossom. Of course, for the ladies. And then you got navy and pink woven. And it comes in this van right here. And then you got smoke woven and mist gray aluminium. So those are all the color choices. Watch. Hold that thought for a moment. Alright, so let's just take a look at all the specs on the box. Okay, so you got your voice control, store and play music, Fitbit Pay. So you can use this to pay with your watch, of course. This is my old Fitbit. We'll talk about this here in a minute. And then you got small and large bands. And okay, let's go over here. All right, so you got built-in Amazon Alexa. So this has Amazon Alexa pre-installed. And, and you can use it to, of course, check the weather and stuff. But we'll go walk through all the steps here in a moment. I got tongue tied right there. And you get all your apps and notifications, and you can sleep with this on, so it's going to track your sleep. And in the battery life, of course, according to the website, it says four days on this, but six days. So, but either way, though, it's pretty good. And you got 24 7 heart rate tracking, it's swim proof. Of course, I went through all the battery life, and then the Amazon Alexa, and then you got your always on display mode, and then you got store and Store and play three, 300 plus more songs, of course. So you, this has some storage on here. We'll get towards that here in a moment. So that's pretty good though to see. You could add some music onto the watch and just rock out. But, all right. So anything I need to check out? Uh, I think we're good to go. All right. Now let's, uh, and oh yeah, real quick. They do have an app that's available for, for Google Play ios or the app store of course and then for the microsoft store too but we'll take a look at that towards the end of the video but we're just going to use my phone at the moment yeah <laughs> all right so let's unbox this see what it is real quick so all right i got the my bark knife of course all right so here we go fitbit versa 2 i want to cut this gently here all right. All right. Ah, my bad. My hand was in the way. <laughs> okay. So, uh, you know what? Ah. <laughs> Watch. Hold up just a second, y'all. All right. My bad, y'all. I figured out how to open it. You have to. There's a little pull tab, of course. Uh, for future reference, of course. Ha. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Fitbit Versa 2. Let's take a look at this. This is a definitely a nice presentation, though. Let's, uh... I'm gonna close this box, though. Just for... For display, of course. Leave that right there. Alright. Had it on the wrong way, of course. 
Okay, so starting off, this is going to be your watch. Set that, put that to the side for a moment. And of course, this is all your stuff that comes in the box, of course. Your usual books and all that good shit. And of course, download the Fitbit app. And we'll do that here in a second. Alright, let's take a look at what else is inside. Okay. Now, this is going to be your charging cable or cradle, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> let's pull this out. I did it the hard way. Okay, so this is going to be your charging cradle. Nice and blacked out. That's dope. And, of course, you got your one of the bands right here. Let's see what else is in here. I'm trying not to... Like, open this box, like, all crazy and stuff. Just trying to be gentle, you know? Alright, so this is it with the band. And, of course, and then your usual books and shit, of course, just set that right there. Okay, and that's pretty much it, but I'm going to put everything back, though. Just for fucking display, you know what I'm saying? Got to keep this box and shit looking fresh all right uh, give me one second y'all all right y'all my bad i was just putting everything back in the box real quick a lot of shit but all right let's take a the walk look at the watch real quick let's uh unwrap this uh plastic here okay a lot of a lot of plastic struggles but but i guess it would help if i just uh Took this, of, took this off, of course. Shit. There it is. Okay, so let's... Alright, so let's peel this off real quick. Alright, so this is your Fitbit Versa 2. And, of course, you got your little charging creator right here. Alright, so this is how it's going to look. And, of course, you got your heart rate monitor right there. This is how you're going to charge it up. And then your Fitbit branding right there. And then your button right here. Let's power this on real quick. See if we got any juice. Okay, so there it is. But definitely feels nice though. It's The band's got like a matte feel to it. Alright. So I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to get this all set up on the Fitbit app. And then we'll be right back. Alright, stand by. Oh yeah, just real quick. Now here's my old Fitbit uh, Blaze right here. I've had this for a couple years. I've had this watch for a good while. Last me the whole way and stuff. And then here's the Versa 2. Now I got this band off of Amazon. It's the Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro Band. But yeah, major difference. This one looks reminiscent to an Apple uh, watch almost. But alright, let me finish this setup. Alright y'all, so we're in the process of setting this up. So the first thing you want to do is download the Fitbit app available on Google Play, the App Store. And then you could get it on the Microsoft Store too if you have a Windows laptop. We'll do that towards the end of the video. So, alright. So the device I'm going to be setting up is my Versa 2. Alright, so set up. So... And then you're going to have all these agreements, of course. Okay, so it's it's connected to the charger. Next. Yep. You have to do all this too, but it's searching for the device. Okay, and it's they found my device. Okay. So, watch. Let me, um, uh, all. And then you're going to get this little number on the device too. It's 5765. So it's like any number too, but this is how they set up the code and shit. But yeah. Whoop. Accidentally pressed zoom by an accident. Alright. So it's connecting the device now.
Hold on just a second, y'all. My bad, y'all. The flash was just off. But you already get the idea about linking. You have to link like a code and stuff and then get download the app and stuff. But you already get the idea. But of course, you could, um, what was it? If you want a Fitbit protection plan, you could, uh, get that too. But I'm just going to choose not now. All right, so, and of course, connect to Wi-Fi. Uh, okay, so, so next. Skip Wi-Fi setup. Continue without Wi-Fi. I'll get to this later. All right. Okay, um, all right, so here's all the features you could get. Of course, I already went through the Amazon Alexa. And you got activity tracking, and you got your always on display. You got pay from your wrist, so you can use your smartwatch to pay. And stuff, and you got your sleep tracking and sleep score, of course. So let's take a look at the Amazon Alexa. Okay, so you're going to have to download the Amazon Alexa app. So watch, hold up just a second. My bad, I had to download the Amazon Alexa app. But, okay, so that's already set up. So let's take a look at activity tracking. All right, so you got your steps, you got your distance, you got your active minutes, you got your calories. So all that good stuff right here. Okay, and then let's go back. And then you got your always on display. Of course, you could change different watch faces. But we'll get towards that here in a second. And pay from your wrist. And then add your cards and all that stuff. But there you have it. All those are at your leisure if you want them. Heart rate and exercise. Of course, if you're working out, if you're like big on fitness and all that good shit. Yeah. And you got your sleep score. You got your sleep stages. It basically tracks your sleep. So, all right. And all right. It's going to it's gonna take some time to start getting downloaded. So, I'm going to let this uh, download real quick, so stand by. Alright, y'all, so I finally got this connected, so let's go through the rest of the steps. Alright, it's going to, while on the watch itself, it's going to show you some quick tips, but we'll get towards that here in a second. But let's go through everything on the phone real quick. So, you got your voice and your privacy, so if you want to add your voice, so got it. Okay, and then you got your Amazon Alexa, so let me log in real quick. So I already downloaded this app too, so we're all good to go on this. And it's authorizing the device. As you see, watch, let me, uh, let, and allow. Okay, use location. There we go. So yeah, you could definitely set up Alexa on this watch because this is the main thing about this video. You got your Amazon Alexa built in and then you're getting more features as opposed to that Fitbit Versa, the original. Now you can pick that one up for a hundred bucks now. So, all right. And then how to wake Alexa, you could like press the button initially and then it'll like have that little pop up. So let's press continue. There we go. And then try it on. And we'll do that here in a second. All right. Wear and care tips. Clean your band and wrists regularly. And with a soap-free cleanser, of course. So, yeah. Got to make sure to keep your wrists clean after you take showers. And then washing your hands. And then polish the watch. Knowing me, that's no problem. Because I have OCD myself, you know. If the device gets wet, remove and dry completely after activity. So, yeah, you got to be careful with stuff like this, you know. And then take your device off from time to time. Oh, yeah, so you could charge it and all that stuff. All right, so we're going to press next. All right, and then we're all set. All right, so linking Fitbit up. So, yeah, we'll link this. Yes, allow. 
All right, so it's linking. So press OK. And if it's asking if you want to start the trial and stuff, but I'm going to press X on this one. All right, so let's go through all the specs real quick. All right, so of course, so we already went through Amazon Alexa, and you got your clock faces, you got your apps, media, your wallet, how to use, and then your accessories. So let's go through like how to use, and I'll guide you all the steps real fast. All right, so let's see how I'm going to do this here. All right. All right, so Fitbit. This is a table of contents. You got Fitbit Basics, Daily Goal, and reminder reminders to move, exercise, heart rate, sleep stages, and sleep score, silent alarms, notifications, quick replies, Android only, Amazon Alexa, Always on display, control center, Fitbit Pay, music controls, quick settings, clock faces, apps, change your device, change out your band, wear and care tips. So yeah, I'm going to probably put this on the like the large band, but I'll do that here in a minute. So, all right, so let's get out of here. All right, and Amazon Alexa, of course, we already went through all that. We'll put that to the test here in a second. And then you got your clock faces. So let's... Take a look at all this real quick. And it sees it says my Versa 2. Now by default, it's gonna give you that design. But well, watch, let me tap it real quick. Or wake it. Right, so, and I guess press start, why not? But well, matter of fact, I'll just guide you through the steps after I get it. So but yeah, that's the one that's by default though. But you could add more if you want, I guess. So let's take a look at some. Off of the Fitbit store. Alright, so you got this one right here. You're always on display. Let's explore this one real quick. Alright, so let me see which one I want for my always on display. So there's like many to choose from. Now this is what separates this from the fucking Apple Watch. Apple, pay attention. Get your fucking shit together. All right, so you got a different selection to choose from, of course. So let me see which one's tasteful for me. Let's see, uh, blah, blah. This one looks pretty dope. So yeah, we'll get this one. Install. All right, and then let's check out a few more real quick. Oh, didn't mean to go back. Explore. There you go. And then... I just want to find something that's like, you know, pretty tasteful and all that shit. So, um, let's see. Uh, but yeah, there's a shit ton to choose from. Uh, this one looks pretty cool right here. So I'll do this one. So yeah, select and install. But yeah, there's many to choose from off. Uh, on the Fitbit store so yeah that, that's that's always good to see though all right so let me back up all right and then you got your of course we already went through the, let's go through the apps real quick all right so my apps of course you got your agenda, of course, that's pre-installed. You got your Deezer, you got your Fitbit app right here, the Stravia, got Starbucks card, your settings, and then your timers. You got your tips, your music, so you could, this this thing has like storage, but I'll have to get back to you guys here in a second of how much gigs it has on the storage. But you got your exercise, you got your clocks, you got your alarms, you got your weather, your Spotify, you're relaxed and in Pandora pre installed. So that's always good to see on all these apps right here. So, and then all apps. And I'm pretty sure you could get some installed too if you want. Okay, cool. And as you see here, you got your calculator. So, yeah, why not? We'll add the calculator. 
you you go you paid 150 bucks for this uh Fitbit Versa 2. Enjoy it. So let's back up here. Let's see what else we have. Of course, we got we already mentioned Spotify and I got Walgreens. Because I have a balanced rewards card, so I'm gonna probably use this one. So yeah, why not? But yeah, there's many apps to choose from though. Like what I'm seeing here. So this is pretty cool. It's basically like a smartphone on your wrist. Just like the Samsung uh, Galaxy Watch. Or the Watch Active 2. But of course. Yeah, all, you got all that stuff too. But yeah. But many to choose from though. Many to choose from. And then uh, media. Of course, you got so no headphones or speaker, but you got you can pair those up to your uh, watch too. But we'll do that here in a minute. You got Spotify, and you got Pandora, Deezer, and then your personal music. So let's set it up now. But matter of fact, I'll do this later. It's all good. It's all good. And of course, your accessories. Let's take a look at this real quick. Okay, it's going to take you to the Fitbit website. But I'll have to, because I'm going to do like a real review on this uh, Fitbit Versa 2, so there'll be more things to talk about and all that stuff. Watch me back up my camera real quick. There we go. All right, and then you got your wallet, so let's take a look at this real quick. So get started. So setting up your wallet. And checking for pin. Set pin. Alright. Let me uh, do this real quick. Two. But yeah, you could do all that too. And it's confirming my pin. So I wait for it to set up real quick. Okay. And you could have it enabled. And you could have it enabled for Fitbit Pay only. So by default, it's enabled. But yeah, might as well just leave it on. Enjoy it. You know, like I said, you paid for a hundred. You paid a hundred and fifty bucks for it. So enjoy it. And then you could add all your credit and debit cards, of course. Let me get this in the focus here. And then, um, so let's take a look at this. But matter of fact, watch. Hold up. I'll set this up, but you get the idea, though. All right, my bad, y'all. I didn't want to put it all on blast like that, so and then it didn't even accept my card. But you got all those features on your wallet, too, so you could use your uh, thing to pay and stuff. But, all right, let's take a look at the actual watch itself. All right, so I got the watch all set up, so let's check it out. So, here's your, well, it starts off with the shortcut, so let me swipe that real quick. Press and hold the button. Oh, okay. Don't myself wasn't paying attention. Okay, and watch, hold up, let me insert a pin. Okay, so, you got all your features right here. Select shortcut, press and hold left button to activate. So you got your Fitbit Pay, you got your Alexa, got your exercise, music controls. But matter of fact, since I'm probably not going to use this for music, I'm just going to leave it on Alexa. Why not? Okay. So next, notifications in control center. So let's swipe down one more time. Okay. So... This is going to be your notification panel right here. It's like you can have it on your music and stuff. And then got it. Quick settings. We'll got, I'll guide you through all this here in a minute. And then you got your music right here. Got it. And then connect your phone. I'll do that later. Got it. For payment. Okay. Next. Got it. Okay. And let's take... Okay. Oh, this is pretty lit. It's pretty lit. But come to think of it, I think I'm just going to leave it on the default one. 
or let me take a look at the watch faces real quick. I'm uh, doing this live though, so clock faces. So let's uh, set this up initially real quick. And I'll just leave it on default, why not? But this is pretty lit though. I'll probably have this one later on. Oh, there it is. There it is. Give it a far star rating. There we go. Alright, so let's go through all the specs on the watch real quick. Of course, this is your main screen. The time's 558, so almost 6. And this is how much steps I did. Because this is all coming from my old uh, Fitbit device. Alright. Watch, hold up, my bad. There we go. Alright. Yeah. Watch, hold up just a second, y'all. Alright, my bad. I had to unlock it, I guess. Watch let me do this again, but I'm not going to pause it this time. So, here's everything from right here. Oop. Thing is trolling me, dude. Alright, so, you got all of your apps right here. You got your exercise, you got your timer, alarm, Spotify. You got your relax, you got your weather, music, wallet, settings, Pandora, Deezer, and Strauss, Starbucks, because you got, I guess you got a thing for Starbucks, I guess, but I fucking hate Starbucks, so we'll just leave it at that. All right, and you got your tips, you got your clocks, your agenda, calculator. These are all the apps that I installed. So let's uh, take a look at uh, the Alexa feature real quick. Alexa. Alexa. Or hold it down real quick. Yeah, this thing's trolling me with the pen, dude. Okay, let's uh, take it over to the Alexa. What's the weather for tomorrow? Okay, there you have it. All right. Alexa, what's the weather for tonight? What's the weather for tonight? What's the weather for tonight? Okay, there you have it. But yeah, this is pretty nice though. I'm, I like the build quality. They did a pretty good job with the build quality. Kind of the James Bond says. Yeah. All right, let's see how it looks on the wrist though. Alright, so this is my first time doing it on camera, of course, blah, blah, blah. But, but yeah, I'm digging this uh, black band, though. Watch, let me do this on the other side real quick. Make it easier. But in the meantime, how's y'all's uh, week? Or weekend? Since we're already on Monday, of course. <laughs> While I'm waiting. Okay, there it is. There it is. Okay, now yeah, this this band is pretty tight, but this is how it's gonna look on your wrist, though. But yeah, same as the the Fitbit Blaze, of course. And you got your um, things right here. Yeah, basically the same setup. But yeah, though I'm definitely feeling this watch. But alrighty, man. But, just real quick, let's just uh, pair this up to the phone. So, stand by. But yeah, just a reminder, with the always on display by default, it's off. So, let's customize it. Clock style. Digital. Yeah, we'll leave it on digital. Status bar. Core stats. All that good stuff. And then, there you go. Alright, stand by. Oh yeah, just real quick, how you change the band out. So you just gotta snap it on like this. Gotta do it gently though. Just make sure it all goes in. Ha. Yeah, I gotta line it up with the little dots that are in there. 
It is what it is, man. Okay. But you get the idea, though. I'm trying to do this fucking fast, though. But yeah, as you see, you got those little, tiny little dots in there. Okay. Just hold up. But yeah, you have to snap on the bands, though, if you want to change, like, band designs and stuff. But it is what it is. Yeah. Watch, hold up. Let me get this all set up. Alright, my bad, y'all. I guess um, you have to like hold the little pins down just to put it in there, but there it is. Uh, but let's do a fit test real quick, and then here's your always on display. This is pretty cool. I'm I'm definitely feeling this watch. All right, let me just put it on my wrist real quick, and let me guess get this in the video here. There it is. Okay, so yeah, that's all good it's gonna get, but there you go. But alright, let's wrap this up. Oh yeah, just real quick, how do you get this in the charger? You you like squeeze these down with like two fingers. So and then there's your little charging thing right there. So let's charge this up. There you have it. All right, let's wrap this up. All right, so overall, on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm giving this watch a definite A-plus for damn sure. This watch is pretty dope, dude. It's already time to start uh, like putting this in the drawer of the Fitbit uh, Blaze. It lasts me a good while, though. I'm thinking about getting a band for this watch, because they do have a band like this. Just for fun, it's going to look like this. But I was going to look into that band. We'll do some band videos and stuff. But, yeah, I'm giving this watch a definite A+. And, of course, you got your Alexa feature and stuff, so that's pretty good to see. So, yeah. Anyways, Fitbit Versa 2, unboxing, first impressions, and then a live setup. I'm sorry for the blur and all that stuff on the first two parts of the video, of course, but you already get the idea, though. But, alright, quick channel update, though, so stand by. Alright, so here's what I got coming up on the channel this week. I got the Skull Candy Ink Plus Active. I'm going to be doing those. And then I got a couple from Anchor, of course. I got the Liberty Ear 2s. That'll be this week as well. And then I got the life notes like I was mentioning on the videos. So that's all coming up this week. So stay tuned. But again, here's me one more time. Shit. Definitely filling this watch though. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of the Fitbit Versa 2 unboxing, first impressions, and live setup. But here, give me in a few days and I'll do the real review. Seeing how everything works on this watch and stuff. And see how Alexa does. Let's do it just one more time. Alexa. But I would have to probably just press the button. But I'll do that on, on the real review though. I'm going to be covering every details about this watch. Get some more watch faces. This is the temporary one I'm going to rock out for now. But, and then uh, you already seen I'm going to be reviewing three pairs of headphones this week. So, stay tuned for all that. But, as usual, I'm Paul Radio Man 2094. I'm out, y'all. See you guys in the next video. Later.